Welcome to I Question PH. The today's question is What are prime and composite numbers? Prime numbers are numbers with exactly two distinct factors, one and itself. Example. 7 is a prime number. Why is it so? We cannot multiply other whole numbers like 2, 3, or 4 together to make 7. Only 1 and itself. 7. But what about 6? Is it also a prime number? Can we multiply any other whole numbers to make 6? Yes, we can. Aside from 1 times 6, we can multiply 2 and 3 to make 6. The factors are 1, 2, 3, and 6. It means 6 is not a prime number. We call it a composite number. Composite numbers are numbers with more than two distinct factors. There are numbers that can be divided up easily, like 8. 8 is equal to 2 times 4. It means we can divide 8 into two groups, like this. Or four groups, like this. But 5 cannot be divided up easily. So based on the given illustrations, 8 is a composite number because it can be divided up exactly. And 5 is a prime number because it cannot be divided up exactly. Sometimes a number can be divided exactly many ways, like 12. 1 times 12 is equal to 12. 2 times 6 is also 12 and 3 times 4 is 12 so it means 12 is a composite number the factors of 12 are 1 2 3 4 6 and 12 how about 1 is it a prime or a composite number. One can only be multiplied by itself. One times one. The factor is only one. Therefore, one is neither prime nor composite. Here is a table of numbers with their factors. So here we have one, to 10. As we've learned, 1 is neither prime nor composite because it only has one factor. 2 has two factors, 1 and 2. So it means it is a prime number. 3 also has two factors, 1 and 3. So it is a prime number. 4 has 3 factors. It means 4 is equal to 1 times 4 and 2 times 2. Therefore, 4 is a composite number. Next is 5. Again, it has 2 distinct factors. 1 and 2. 5. So it is a prime number. 
6 has 4. 6 is equal to 1 times 6 and 2 times 3. So it is a composite number. 7 has only 2. So it's a prime number. 8 has 4. 1 times 8 and 2 times 4. So it's a composite number. 9 has 3. 9 is equal to 1 times 9 and 3 times 3. It means it's a composite number. And 10 has 4 factors. 10 is equal to 1 times 10 and 2 times 5. So 10 is a composite number. Again, take note that prime numbers are numbers with exactly two distinct factors, one and itself. While composite numbers are numbers with more than two distinct factors. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Till next time.